Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Recently saw a request to figure out how to count the number of hyperlinks that this individual had in a list of information on one of their worksheets. So I thought I'd do a post showing how you can count them, highlight them, and even delete hyperlinks from a list of items that you have. So let's take a look and see how we can do that in Excel. So here we have a list and you can see it's a hodgepodge of links to uh, places in my workbook, uh, names, numbers, various locations, uh, links to websites, etc. And it looks like we have a total of 162 items uh, in our list. And what we want to do is just be able to identify the hyperlinks and also to uh, highlight them, count them, and even possibly delete them. So the first thing I'm going to do is highlight the list. I'm just going to select cell A2 and hit uh, Control Shift down arrow to highlight the entire list. And then hit Control F to bring up the Find and Replace box. And I'm going to select Options. And here, what we're going to do is we're going to find any cell that has the format of a hyperlink. So I'm going to click on the down arrow for format, choose format from a cell, and I'm going to select one that has a hyperlink. And notice in the preview it shows that type of formatting uh, for what we're going to search for. And I'm going to click on find all, and you can see Excel has already told me it found 40 instances of cells that have that type of formatting in them. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to expand this out and you can see the whole list and if you scan through the values you can see they're either links or websites that is included in what Excel has found. Now that I have the first item highlighted I'll go down to the last item, hold down my shift key, click that and now it has selected all of them and you can see in my list it is highlighted every cell that has a hyperlink. So now I can go ahead and close this and as I scroll through my list you can see all the cells that are highlighted have either a link with a number after it which is a link to somewhere in my worksheet or a link to an external website um, as you can see in several of those instances. Now I can go through I can click on fill color in this case I'm just going to use the yellow highlight and now all of those have been highlighted in yellow. So all the links are now identified by a highlight. From here, I can click somewhere anywhere into my list, go to the Data tab, and put the filters on. And if I click my down arrow, I can filter by color. I can select that. And now I have just the list of items that are hyperlinks within my list. And if I select that list, hit shift control down, you can see the count at the bottom indicates that I have 40, which is the same number that was shown when I had my find and replace, and it indicated that it had found 40 instances of items with a hyperlink. Now the last thing I wanted to do is delete my hyperlinks. Let's say that's what we want to do. I'm going to again go ahead and highlight this list and I'm going to hit the keyboard shortcut alt semicolon which is selecting visible cells only. Now I've selected those visible cells I can just hit my delete key and now all my hyperlinks are gone. And while I have it here I'm going to go to the home tab and just select no fill so there's no fill included there at all. Now I'm going to go back and select all from my filters, say OK, or I could have gone to the Data tab and clicked on the Clear button here in my Sort and Filter group. And now all the hyperlinks are gone, and I just have blanks in their places. Now let's say I want to go through and delete those blanks so I can consolidate my list, eliminate the blanks, and I just have a list of names and numbers and locations. I'm going to again uh, select the first item in my list, hit shift page down until I get down to the bottom. So I've selected my whole area. 
Now I'm going to hit the F5 key, which brings up my go to box. I'll highlight special or click on special, select blanks, hit OK. Now it has just highlighted the blanks that I have within my list. Now from here, I can go up to the Home tab, go to the Cells group, select Delete, and I can have Delete Sheet Rows. Click that. All those rows have been deleted, and now what I have left is just a list of 122 items that are names, numbers, or fictitious locations. All my hyperlinks are gone, and I've eliminated the blanks that I had on my list. And there you have it. I hope you like what you see. If you do like what you see here, please take a minute to share this post on your favorite social network. I can be found on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, LinkedIn, and YouTube. So I hope you enjoy this. If you'd like to see more, please feel free to stop by my website, excel-bytes.com, and I hope you subscribe. So have a great day and happy excelling.